A directive developed during the Bush administration is calling for all cities, counties and states to change street signs by 2015. The signs will be more reflective and feature upper and lower case lettering that should be easier to read and increase safety. But it's something a lot of cities can't afford to do right now. Uh, it will be difficult to comply with now in the time frame. Hilliard's Director of Public Service, Clyde Seidel, says they've been updating the signs in new road projects. We actually have some signs that right now we would rather not have to change out. We believe they're fully readable, they comply with the reflectivity, which I, in, in our opinion is the more important issue. But signs, some consider to be perfectly good signs, at some point are going to have to change to meet requirements. It's a cost Hilliard says is not in the budget right now. Cities like Upper Arlington have their own sign shop, which saves them money. This sign costs them only $50 to make, compared to Hilliard, who has to contract their signs out. That costs Hilliard $125 to $150 for each sign. Columbus says it depends on the size, but each sign would be $92 to $266. And some cities like Worthington say they're already taken care of. We're looking approximately around 60000 per year for signs, and that's just for the name signs and for the reflectivity of the signs themselves. These two signs are examples of what Upper Arlington's new signs will look like, and with new machinery, they can make them the way they want to at a savings. In Upper Arlington, Steve Wayne for NBC4.